themehq.com and today I'm here to show you how you can easily find and delete all those old screenshots that you have in your photo library. I manage my photos with Photoshop Elements and it is pretty easy for us these days to quickly take a screenshot and then forget about it and leave it in our photo library. So we end up with dozens of these little images and who knows whether they're important or whether we need to keep them. So here's a couple of ways that you can easily find and delete your screenshots. The first and simplest way is to just go to your find, buy details metadata and then click file name ends with PNG. All of your screenshots will be PNG files. Your screenshots from your um, computer, uh, from your phones, they'll all be screen, they'll all be PNG files. So then it's just a matter of browsing through and selecting the ones you want to delete. So I'm just going to do that for mine here. I don't need to keep these. So when you've selected all of the screenshots that you don't want to keep, you can click right click and then you can click delete selected items from catalog. You can choose to just delete them from the catalog and leave them on your hard drive. I don't recommend that because then you've still got photos that have unmanaged um, but you can do that so I'm just going to click also delete selected items from the hard drive because that is what we want to do. We want to get rid of these for good so let's click OK and it's going to delete those 18 PNG files. Now if you want to be a little bit more precise about which um, which um, screenshots you're looking for, you don't want to have all the random PNG files that you may have downloaded all coming up in your search, you can actually search for the specific dimensions of your screenshots. So if I go back to my full photo library, all I need to do is scroll down until I see a screenshot. Sorry, this is lagging a bit. Unfortunately, my computer doesn't love streaming. So I'm just going to scroll down through here until I find a screenshot here's a good one so this one is um, to find your the exact dimensions of your screenshots You just need to click on the keyword um, slash info tab there. And then you can see under size, it's got the size in kilobytes, but it's also got the size in pixels. So for example, let's do this one here, which I know is mine. I, I don't want to search on my husband's screenshots um, because he can manage his own. <laughs> We've got several phones and over the years, of course, the dimensions have changed as the, um, as the resolution of our phones has improved. So in this case, it's 828 and the pixel height is 1472. I'm 
just copying that directly from the information tab here. I'm going to click all of the following selection search criteria. And then I'm going to click search and it'll run through uh, my photo library. Now, I have got 132,585 photos in this library, so it'll take a moment. I probably should have a smaller library for the demos, but this is real life. I'm really cleaning out my photo library, so we can wait a few seconds. And here it is. So here we have um, 401 screenshots. Instagram stories here. So now it's just a matter of me clicking through and selecting which ones we want to delete. You can just select them all and delete all five, 401 in one go. Now, if you are wondering why my screen looks a little different, I like to have it on the view details mode. If you're on the default mode, your screen will look a bit more like this. And it's harder to tell exactly what dimensions the photos are. So I prefer to look at, um, oh, no. I prefer to use the details view just so it's easier for me to see the whole image. It's not cropped to make it look pretty. So there's a bonus tip for you. So do you have a lot of screenshots in your library? Perhaps you're like me and you have iterations of phones and you've still got screenshots from you know, your iPhone 4. Do you remember the days when the phone used to look like that? It's kind of fun to look back on. That's why I'm not deleting every single screenshot I have. But most of them are certainly not something I need to pass on to the next generation. And it can seem overwhelming. So why don't you just do a quick search for all your screenshots. Once again, I'll just show you the simplest way. File name ends with PNG. And that will show all of your screenshots from phones of any dimension and also from your computer screen. Then you can just take a few minutes to browse through and then you'll lighten that load. Of course, you can also do a similar search just within File Explorer or Windows Explorer or Finder, depending on which version of what software you're using. And any photo management software will be able to do a pixel dimension search. And it's just a matter of selecting all of them and saying, goodbye, we no longer need you screenshots. Well, thanks for joining me for our tip of the week. If you'd like to learn more about Photoshop Elements Organizer or Editor, you can head to digitalscrapbookinghq.com.